Hey guys, this here is 2 and today I reviewed the Leapin Likeable Batman movie The Penguin Arctic Roller Set. So this is the box here. So it's uh, pretty big for a uh, 300 piece set because Leapin, you know, made the box size uh, much more bigger than the original one. But yeah, so it's recommended for just... Uh, for just 8 and up, comes with 335 pieces and it's set 07047. So, comes with uh, two main figures which are Batman and uh, the Penguin. So, uh, you can see the top here does have the handle here, and you got this Batman there, and the bottom and uh, the side here. So, you can see, pretty cool. And the other side, nothing else really, just a, a, a damage here for some reason. But yeah, so the back here uh, shows you all the features and uh, it also says uh, the boat does not float, of course, because it's a brick boat, not a full hull piece. But yeah, that's it for the box. And inside does come with uh, this uh, cray box thing, which all the other set, set also have, but yeah. So this is the instruction here, and you can see uh, there's no uh, advertisements and no uh, number backs, which is uh, annoying. And, you know, but yeah, it's only 300 piece, and, it, you know, it's pretty easy to build. But yeah, you just have uh, this thing, which just shows you how to the features that yeah so the back here you got the batman movie poster i guess kind of thing poster kind of thing which you know it's pretty cool but i don't know why leap and want, wanted it to you know still still legos poster but yeah so these are the extra pieces here which you know i don't know why they included it but yeah, uh, the other lead pin sets that by uh, it, uh, it didn't really include extra pieces except for these molds and also the extra spring uh, missile. And yeah, so uh, comes with two of these uh, molds uh, for the Star Wars pistols and you know guns and everything. But uh, it only needed uh, the build only needed one of these. So yeah, the build needed two of those pieces, which I forgot what it is, but yeah, it's a pistol piece, but yeah, it's right here, but yeah, so you can see it comes with two of these studs, uh, this is a uh, transparent and this is the stud with a hole, and you know, some technique pieces, uh, one, uh, one by two, and create extra hands for some reason, and, and also extra Batman's cape for some reason as well or it might just be I split the cape in half or something I don't know but yeah obviously a uh, spring extra spring loaded missile but yeah that's it for the extra pieces the first figure is a uh, Batman of course so it's just like the all the other Batman that uh, we got uh, in all the Batman movie sets so yeah obviously he's armed with uh, two barangs and yeah uh, and his cape here is kind of different because I think I turned it uh, in half so yeah I guess that's why we I got the extra cape but yeah so you know uh, the torso printing pretty simple you got uh, the basketball in the middle and you got his utility belt which is another mode and just like all the other Leapin Batman movie Batman the uh, with this uh, utility belt uh, this torso is very loose so yeah that's problem but yeah so you can see uh, you got his uh, face here and does have a double sided face and you got his I don't know angry kind of face but yeah so this is the back printing Pretty simple, basic printing. So that's it for Batman. Second figure is uh, the Penguin, of course. So uh, you can see he has his umbrella, uh, which is the you know folded in umbrella, and 
yeah, it's uh, pretty nice uh, that Li Pin made this mold. And yeah, so you can see you got his very big hat. And uh, you remove it, you can see uh, you got a uh, penguin's angry face. And yeah, the skin tone is uh, different than the usual figures. And yeah, so you can see this uh, scarf thing here is very loose, which is annoying. And yeah, it's not molded so well, but yeah, so the torso printing, uh, you can see just uh, some, just a little tie, I guess, in the middle, and also uh, two of these pouches, and you know, uh, with his really fat skin. But yeah, he doesn't have any back printing, but does have side arm printing, which is nice uh, for his uh, sleeves or something, but. Yeah, pretty nice uh, figure actually, uh, Leapin. But yeah, so that's it for Penguin. So this is the Penguin's Arctic Roller here. So yeah, uh, it's the only build of the set here, obviously. So let's start off by taking a look at the front. So the front here, it got uh, these headlights. So you got the both uh, of these uh, main headlights on. On top there and you got these side ones which are connected to these great arms and they are pretty loose actually you have and the bottom here I'm not sure if these are lights or whatever lights but yeah so here you got the spring -load missile and you got the high flyer license plate and you got the penguin uh, logo so uh, the top here you got uh, these grill sticker piece and you also got this um, Spring Lusher act activator kind of thing, and you got this uh, printed piece in the middle, which is a turbine kind of thing. And yeah, the Spring Lusher doesn't really work actually. If you see, I press it down, it doesn't work, and yeah, that's kind of problem. So yeah, the side here got some uh, designs there, and uh, you know, you got uh, this horn piece over here, and you got the side view mirrors, which is connected to this uh, pistol piece, and uh, and they use uh, the hot air balloon piece as the wheel cover, and you got this really large wheel at the front there, and uh, you got these uh, revolvers as the uh, as the exhaust. So that's uh, pretty neat, and yeah. Uh, so here uh, on the door part here, you got this uh, missile or kind of torpedo thingy, uh, which yeah, it's just clip on to this fish with this piece at the front, and yeah, I guess this is the weapon of the vehicle, I guess, but. Yeah, I'm, I'm not quite sure, so, yeah, there is a problem here at the windshield, which, yeah, I, I don't know why, like, it's the, it happens with uh, leaping sets, actually, and, yeah, it, it just looks really bad, but, yeah, that's just leap, leaping, and, yeah, so the top here got a, a sticker piece, uh, for some design and you also got a grill piece here and you remove this in order to gain access into the cockpit so the cockpit got this meter dial thing you know which is pretty cool and you also got the steering wheel and uh, there's two of these uh, jumper plates which you can put uh, put in penguin and he fits in there pretty nicely and uh, the the back here uh it does have a crunk actually but yeah uh the if you didn't see this uh it does have uh both of these uh back wheels so yeah that's that and you know you got these tail lights which yeah it's just uh cheese slope pieces and uh you also got this high flyer um uh, license plate and this crunk you can just open it up and uh, it reveals this secret secret uh, penguin escape boat thingy which yeah uh, it's just a very simple build with a couple of pieces so you just got a uh, single at the front and also this uh, thing at the back to connect it to the to the back here to this tech to that Technic Axle piece 
So, yeah, that's a uh, nice design. And if you remove this, I guess you can put other stuff in there. But, yeah, it, it will it will drop out since here, uh, here has a gap there. And, yeah, but that's that's like pretty much it for the penguins arctic roller so you know but the this is the bottom view if in case you're in case you're wondering and i don't know why they have these side uh this piece poking out at the side but yeah that's just that so yeah that's uh pretty much it so uh conclusion uh, how do I think of this set? So I think, uh, I mean, uh, this set here is, you know, pretty cool. Uh, the figures, uh, I mean, Penguin is the only one that is not very good. And Batman is exactly as expected. And uh, the boat here, uh, the sprinkler missile, and got a problem there. And you also got a problem with the wind windscreen piece. And, you know... Like, ex aside from both of those major problems, uh, there's not really any problems. And, yeah, the Springer's um, sure is just the Leapin's fault because they always, they are all they are Springer's sure, they are all uh, very faulty. So, yeah, but uh, the windscreen, I'm not sure why, but yeah, the rest of the build, they are all pretty good and uh, it's kind of bad that it doesn't have a number back since it has like the small like Mr. Freeze Ice Attack set even has a uh, number back so yeah I don't know why this doesn't have number backs but yeah so overall quality of this set is not so good but yeah I do recommend this set if you can afford the official Lego one so yeah buy for this down in the description box below along with other social media pages down in the description so if you're a job physical alternative bricks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But thanks for watching, I'll be seeing you very soon.